And so we have a major update in the story of the beloved family pet rodent that was wanted by state authorities. Wildlife and fisheries are now taking steps to allow the Lacoste family to keep their pet Nutria. And joining me now are Lily Cummings and Whitney Miller. They've been covering the story which, since the very beginning, actually, by the way. It started as really an innocent feature about yeah. a, a little Nutria that became sort of a big time local celebrity. Exactly. Yeah. So NOLA.com had the story and I thought, man, this would be great for TV. I want to meet this Nutria. As mm -hmm. you know, I held him. Oh, in God. my hands, in my hands. <laughs> Anyways, so we thought, you know, this is a great fun story. It got yeah. a lot of reaction. And then the next thing you know, he was wanted by wanted. the Louisiana Department of Wildlife and Fisheries. Yeah. And that's where I come in. That's where Whitney comes I in. I called because we heard that they were going to come to their home uh, to, to retrieve, confiscate the right. nutria. And it was... You know, I never heard of a nutria until I moved here. Yeah. Now I know what a nutria is. <laughs> um, but this family really, really loves nudie. Yes. And you can just see just the pain in their faces that these people were, you know, trying to take it away. They were asking, what can we do? What right. can what can be done? So today, the good news, they yeah. have a permit. I thought it was really unfortunate because, you know, when somebody builds a connection, I, and let me just say this for full disclosure, I do not, I didn't, I was freaked out when you were holding the nutria. <laughs> I grew up seeing these things in canals and I was always afraid of them and I also knew about their history kind of, uh, you know, destroying the marshes. So, you know, you sympathize with people yeah. though because it seemed like there was a special connection here and for some reason the entire community has rallied around this family. 14,000 plus people on a, on a change.org. I think it was over 15,000 right. by, by around five. Right. Wow. Yeah. I mean, there have been t-shirts, there have been people talking on social media, <laughs> yeah. and some people just felt like it was so wrong to take away something that this this family just loves and the community loves. And I think people identified more with that. Right. Versus and Indian. they weren't trying to, and they want to be clear that they weren't trying to break any laws. They didn't know that this was illegal to have, um, but they, they they were shocked to find out that it was, that this was the law that they um, had to follow. Okay. So, so now that they have a, they, they have, are coming up to a resolution, what's happening right now? So they are working on a permit right. that they can have so that they can keep the nutrient home because it is still illegal for anyone to have a pet nutria. You can't right. have a pet nutria, uh, but they're working on a permit. And some of those permits include being a rehabilitator. And I'm, I'm not sure if this permit that they're working on with this family will be that, mm -hmm. but that is the only permit before today that you could have had to keep a nutria at home. All right, so I know a lot of people are just concerned that if, if they rescue, just don't go out and rescue nutria <laughs> right. consistently. I think that's what they were worried about. Right, mm -hmm. and that's why th this family did ask. They rescued this nutria, they asked uh, Jefferson Parish, could we? Can we keep it? So there might have been some confusion there with the answer, um, but they they even said we didn't want to grow attached to this thing. But that's why they asked if they could keep it. Uh, they're already attached to they it. They attached A now. A lot of us are. It seems like. <laughs> yes. At this point, I think Nudie is about to become the town He's mascot, famous. the city mascot right now. <laughs> that's is. just where we are. All right. Uh, thank you guys. You can, Whitney, Lily. Uh, this has been a wild 24 hours. Very much so. I will tell you that literally, <laughs> wild 24 hours. Thank you guys so much.